Hi guys. Hey guys. So Bob and I are up here at one of our new favorite walking places in Thompson Station and we thought it'd be a great opportunity to share with you a little bit about our new song called Bluegrass Boy that's coming out on the 27th. Um, it's a story that we're, we're just excited about because of the story that comes with it. There's kind of layers to the story. Um, but it's really probably only the second uh, song that we've written together. Yep. Um, which has been fun. To, it's to, been interesting for yeah, sure. Yeah, to write together um, in our first uh, bluegrass song that we've written together. Um, so yeah. Yeah, we both like uh, bluegrass music and uh, she came home one evening and uh, we were sitting at the kitchen table uh, and she was kind of rehashing the day and an interaction she had with a young man named Jesse. Uh, you want to share what that looked like? Yeah, um, so Jesse's part of one of the writing worship community that I'm a part of and um, we were just chatting through Facebook Messenger one day sharing songs and encouraging each other and um, so he sent me one of his worship songs to listen to and as I was listening um, I could hear kind of just undertones of bluegrass or kind of almost like a Celtic sound in a way behind his music and started talking to him about that. And so I was sharing with Bob at dinner, you know, just like he said, rehashing the day. And I was sharing, like I had this really cool talk with uh, this young man, Jesse. And um, I said, I could hear like banjo in this boy because we come to find out that he actually plays a banjo. <laughs> and um, so he's actually, so when you see the song um, come out and available, he's the cover picture on the song Bluegrass Boy because we really wanted to honor the him and the conversation that came from that. So as I was telling him about that and said like, boy, I could really, I could hear like banjo in that boy. Well, I'm a poet and so I'm always listening for uh, clever phraseology or, you know, unique inspiration of, of words, you know, joined together. And when I heard that, I said, that's a song or a lyric. I can hear the banjo in that boy. And uh, we sat down and uh, it turned out to be uh, the Bluegrass Boy. And so we hope you guys like it. Yeah, and yeah, I think it was just, we actually recorded the conversation we had. It was at the dinner table, like you said. Yeah. And uh, so I have that and I'm gonna share it with you guys so you can hear it because um, it's basically the very beginning of the song and you're gonna hear, I'm, I'm excited too for you to hear how amazing Bob is because he literally was just speaking the song right at the dinner table. And I'm so glad I captured it. And when you hear the song, you will hear um, even the very beginning of the song. What's the very beginning um, of the song? A young boy from Kentucky on his way to Tennessee. Yeah, he like spoke that. So I want you guys to hear that conversation and just get a little glimpse of the inspiration and the story behind the song. Um, the echo in those mountains sing along. He's trying to get away from it. His roots. Yeah, well, I'm saying it's like maybe not. He's really consciously trying to get away from it, but he's thought like this is the one way that I I have to go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Obviously, and, he's playing. Yeah. Yeah, and he's walked away from <coughs> the roots. Right, 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 right. He yeah. walked away from That'd the roots. Right, that'll be good. It'll be so good. He walked away from the roots to pursue the dream. But I could hear the banjo in that. But I could hear the banjo in that. It like good. almost makes me want to cry. Yeah, that'll write good. That'll write good. Resuming. Okay, say what you said. A young man from Kentucky on his way to Tennessee out of the hills of the mountains or maybe bluegrass. But every time <sighs> I heard him sing, I could hear the banjo in that boy. Fire. Every time I heard him play, he had a double 12 string or a six string. He rested upon his knee. But I could hear the banjo in that boy. But there's more to this story. Because this old boy from Kentucky, that's where I could hear the bluegrass in this boy. I could no, hear no. The Is it obvious to everybody else <clears throat> or just the person that's singing? But I could hear, like, I, but I could hear the banjo in that boy. And then really hope that you guys are going to enjoy this song. It's the purpose and the heart behind it is to just be true to the sound that's inside of you and to let that out. Uh, God put that inside of you and he wants you to share that with the world. So 
Uh, thank you guys and I hope you guys have a great and beautiful day and that it's lovely like this where you are. See you guys.